Hey, come here, sleepyhead. <sighs> come on, it's just the sun. Look, it's worth it. Whoa! It's... Well, it's... Like a dream? Yes, exactly like my dream. Quickly, let's eat something and get going. Come on. Hey, we're here to know why you dreamt about this place, right? Yes, let's go! What perfect weather for exploration. Yes, island explorers! Let's find the exit first. <laughs> Look at that! It's so big! Now I'm counting on you, all right? If you see anything... Yes! I'll keep my eyes piled! Peeled? <laughs> we say keep my eyes peeled. Oh! That's horrible! It's... <laughs> yes, it's horrible. This place truly is something. It's so big! I would get lost. I could get used to it. Would you be a countess? Oh, no. Too many responsibilities. Good day to you. Good day. Thank you. It's going to be a hot day. Oh, you're right about that. I can't imagine having to wear that helmet. Is well, that the way out? Rough yesterday I suppose. Harbor, Let's so. ask this guard. Yes. I heard about that. Better say... Hello. Can we go outside? Sure. Enjoy the brighter days. Slept well? Sophia, hi! Nice to see you! How did you know? Where you'd be? That's my life, sweetheart. Wake up early, observe, listen, and make the best of it. That's how I discovered Arno is in jail. Yes, that bastard. He betrayed us. And worse, he used Hugo. What kind of use could he make of such a tiny creature? Or... Are you more useful than you look like, little one? I'm not joking, Sophia. Arno may be your friend, but he almost got us killed. So you spent the night celebrating his capture with the Count of Provence and his wife? No, I don't care about them. I kneel to no lord, Sophia. No count, no king, no one. I only care about him. All right. I had a nerve there. I was teasing you. I'd just like to know who my friends really are. And I like what I hear. Come. Let's take a walk. Yes! I took some time to wander around this morning. Do you know where you're going yet? Not yet, no. Take your time. Weather's just fine. People are partying. Even the guards are quite nice. This is why we're not in jail already. Oh, bird! 
that. You're right. Is it the one from your dream? Almost. It's funny. It looks like it's looking at something. Oh, a treasure hunt. Already? Well, let's see what he sees. So, a dream and a bird. Hmm. Hugo's been dreaming about this place a lot since before we came here. And each time there was a bird. All right. Why not? You're right. So what's this one looking at? Only one way to find out. Everything's so different from Guyen. Even the smells. Yes, it smells hot. It's never hot in Guyen. Not in the same way. I trust you. Just a few more tiles. Hello there. Hello. Searching the birds, Amicia. You ready? Just about. I don't want to miss the ceremony. I'd like to see the stone birds again. Interesting. Oh, it's looking at that house. Your answer might be in there. Oh, there's another one. Let's have a look. You seen that sky? Yes. 
couldn't hope for brighter days. Happy brighter days. days to you. I just Happy hope brighter you days. Your well, no, yes. they'll be just Same to you. perfect. Thank the child. Looking at? I'm not sure a centuries old bird is interested in a tent. How about we just go have a look? Yes. Are you going to the fertility site? With my wife, yes. Maybe this year will be the one for us. I hope so. You both deserve the child's blessing. Just looking at that sculpture. Oh, well, don't let me stop you. I can't see the next one. It must be hidden behind that small hill. Onward! Oh, these youngsters chasing rocks off. instead of gold. <laughs> this is all nice, but wouldn't the church consider it utter heresy? Yes, you have to be a count to take that kind of risk. This island is pretty remote. I guess that helps. And there's no eye gold can't close. One more! Say, that's a large family of birds. Let's find another one! Imagine if it led to a real nest. No, it's something meaningful. It has to be. I'm sure it is. Back to hunting birds. Searching the birds, Amicia. What's going on here? Not too tired, Hugo. No, I'm good. We've walked a lot. This island is quite big. It's big, but it's beautiful. I like bird. I think they've led us in a spiral. And we're getting to its center. This is it. What do you see? I see columns. It's beautiful. Nice find. Some sort of uh, antique theater? Yes. It looks important. <sighs> now let's see.
<sighs> Shame I don't have a torch. We'll take care of that grass in no time. This is it, Hugo. Your bird showed the way. It's a map of the island. It's antique. I'd say hundreds of years old. Probably Byzantium? There is a lot of those around here. Look, Amicia! There's the drawing! What drawing? The drawing of the Order! Yes! I see it! What Order? A very ancient order of alchemists. You overheard us on the boat, Sophia. Hugo is sick. It's not contagious. Still, the order wanted to lock him away to do whatever they pleased. But I... But you kneel to no one. I get it. So, what did you come here looking for? Whatever can help him. It's simple. If this symbol indicates important areas... That one... Well, that one is pretty hard to miss. The teeth! They're called Las Madres, the mothers. Oh. I know, boring. It makes sense. Let's go visit those mothers then. Those teeth. Are you coming with us? If you want me to. I told you, I owe you. Come on then. Yes, we are gonna climb. The view from up there must be quite a sight. Oh, I can't wait to see it. Come on, up. Yes. Look, there's a house in the teeth. Yes, some kind of uh, temple? Sanctuary, that's what I've heard it called. And now I'm even more curious about it. Sold, this is our first stop. It seems so nice. So we've got a magic bird, an ancient order of alchemists. The little one has visions. <laughs> well, just what else can I expect? Hugo's sickness is special. Our mother's an alchemist, but she couldn't do anything about it. It's almost like a curse. Who could curse such a cute baby? I'm not a baby. It's the bloodline. This thing goes back to the dawn of times. It's unfair, but... This is real, Sophia. In Guienne, the Inquisition came after us over this. We barely made it here. It was horrible. They killed everybody. Damn. All right. We'll find what you came for. You have my word. Thank you. To the sanctuary. So we're done here for now? Yes, let's go. It's gonna be quite a walk. First to the top! Hey, easy, I don't wanna carry you! Chicken! Are you tired?
tired. We've been walking a while. It's not as high as it looks. Don't be disappointed. We're not there yet. <laughs> looks like someone's more tired than you. <laughs> I don't like mountains. Everything I need is at sea level. I like mountains. They're big and tall, so when you're on top of it, you're big and tall too. You know, it's his first time climbing one. Well, in that case, let's be big and tall together. Damn, it's getting hot. Oh. Look, we're almost at the sanctuary. Do you know what almost means? Come on, it will be worth the sweat. Look at the size of it. So what do you expect to find up there? I want to see the real bird. Or the tree. Or the pond. I'd prefer an elixir. Something to really help you, Hugo. Maybe the bird will have it. Oh, spring water! How can he run in this heat? Child skill. He can also fall asleep in a snap. Mm. Mm, it looks so fresh. It is. Just what I need, anyway. Hey, Hugo, you have some dirt on your face. I'll get it for you. Ah! <laughs> Water attack! Hey! <laughs> Counterattack. <laughs> for the Daroons, Hugo! All right, Hugo. all right, all right. I yield. For the you soaked me to death. I win! <laughs> <laughs> A sailor defeated by water. He shot me in the eyes, all right? I did it on purpose. <laughs> That's my brother. Talk about a family. Well done, Hugo. I'll have my revenge. Tree is huge. Yes, carving that must have hurt. Oh, goats! There are a lot of Misia. Don't be scared. They much prefer their olive leaves to little children. Yes, but they scream. I'm here. Well, well, well. Our fierce warrior is afraid of goats. There are too many. You're heading to the child sanctuary. We are. Oh, I'm afraid you're too late. They closed the gate, as you can see, for the ceremony. A ceremony? 
Oh, we came all this way for the little one. Ah, uh, well, that goat path to the side will take you closer, but you'll have to look from afar. The Count and Countess are up there, and the guards are on edge since yesterday's mess. They won't take kindly to uninvited guests. We'll keep that in mind. Thank you. Oh, by the way, if you stumble on Tramontan, please send her back here. She's one of my goats. We'll try. Good luck, then. I hope she won't attack us. Oh, come on. It's a goat, not a wolf. <laughs> but they scream. <laughs> oh, they do. So they locked down the sanctuary. Just our luck. On the bright side, you don't lock a place down if it doesn't hold something important. Yes. I'm even more curious now. Listen, is that the goat you talked about? Tremontan, yes. Inside this house, maybe. Locked. Are we going to help her? That's what heroes do. All right. There may be another way in. She's here! <laughs> we should send you back to your owner. Goats. I stared in their eyes for hours when I was a child. You can't know what's going on in there. You may just not be ready for their knowledge.
Tramon. Let's keep going. But Tramon Tan. She'll find her way back, don't worry. Go to climbers. The sanctuary's more important for now. Thank you for your offerings. Sorry to push you out, but the ceremony will begin soon. Hmm. Soldier. Oh, no problem. Make sure no trouble arises. Yes, we had enough violence yesterday. The child must have hated it. We'll be especially careful. Don't worry. Come on. Good. Uh, well, thank you, Anna. That was to be expected. Climb up. <clears throat> Mind the drop. All right. What do we do with the last offerings? They stay here for now. We'll bring them up there after the ceremony. Looks like they really like their privacy. Clear. What's that smoke? They make it so easy. Damn what, right? These damn There's another uniforms. false alarm. You know the Count. I knew it. He likes to keep it formal. Yeah. Yeah, well... Next time, we'll ask to stand guard near the ruins. There's more shade, and I'd like to see the procession for once. Sophia, your prison would help. Let's capture the light. Huh? Smoke? What's going like on? every time. Here's the door. Let's be quick. Nothing to worry about. Forget it. Sophia, can you use your prism? It won't take long to burn. Hey. Now 
Who's making that? Come on, it works. Fine, I was wrong again. Risky. I'm better now. Thank you, Sophia. It's nothing. It's just my worst nightmare. We should walk a bit on solid ground. Oh, all those flowers. That must be for their ceremony. Soldiers! The Soldiers, to cover quick. Open your eyes. They found more of Arno's men. Don't think so. But the Count's right. That may part is too crowded. Let's go around. Careful. Bastards. Spoiling the most important time of the year. Count wants no soldier inside the sanctuary, all right? Got it! We'll be sacrilege anyway. The child needs peace, not weapons.
Nothing. Fine. Huh? What's that? Making that so they make it so easy. Damn it, what's that? He knows we're here. Oh. Great. False alarm. Smoke looks odd. Works Let's... every time. False alarm. Again. Making that noise. With just a false alarm. Hey. And with nothing. Attacked. Huh? 
Someone's lurking about. Let me know if you see anything. I can't see anyone. I know you're around there somewhere. I'll find you. Wait. So that's where you're hiding. We have trespassers. Keep your eyes peeled. Someone's lurking about. Let me know if you see anything. With you! What? Strange. Someone's hiding in the area. Let me know if you see anything. I'm going. No one We're doing it, my friends. Get We're getting there. They're not here. Whew. Yes. How do you feel, Hugo? I feel funny, but good. I'm sure there's something inside the mountain. I feel it too. Well, I'm trusting you both. Everyone, it is almost time. Gather round, please. It's the Count and the Countess. It seems we're right on time. We need to jump down. We're still <laughs> waiting for a few latecomers. Oh. Feel free to come closer in the meantime. Latecomers. I'd say that's us. What are we going to do? We'll uh, think about it. Friends and children, today marks the longest day of the year. The light of the summer solstice shines upon us once again. And yet, in these cold hallways, hidden from the sun, the child of embers still slumbers. It is time to bring the flame of the phoenix. The phoenix. To his dormant That's embers. Your bird. Thus will we prove that we deserve to care for him. Like mother. Like father. Let us pray together before we enter. What do you think? Bold, but believable. Are we dressing up? Open your mind and heart. It is now time to tell his tale. So that it is never forgotten. What do we do? Let's follow them or not. Huh? And do what they say. They mustn't recognize us. Yes. Come on. Centuries ago, a child was born on this land. His heart was blessed by the sun, from which he inherited the flame that rules everything. And so was born the child of fire. What? His flame shone over the world. He blessed it with his perfume, his laughter, his joy. 
Of all places, Lacuna was his home. It became a land of life and peace, a place to heal, to thrive. Lacuna became a cradle of light. But light tempts evil. And evil knows no mercy. Come. A child on a throne, in an order temple. It's him, the child of Embers. Take your place at our sides. Look, the drawing. It's the carrier of the macula. That fresco was in Mother's laboratory at home. Please kneel. Evil found the child inside these very halls. It fed on his fire, weakened it, marked his flesh with cold black scars. His mother's arms couldn't warm him anymore. And so his light faded, almost entirely. And the child of fire turned into the child of embers. Lord! A dark era began. Men forgot about him, but we did not. This flame is the last gleam of his light. Our hope. And now, two of you, a woman and a child, will carry it through his night. You. Your heads are bent. Your humility honors you. You will walk his flame through his darkest hours. Take it. You will walk in his steps. Know the cold that bites the flesh. The drowning in the absence of light. The uncertainty. You will see the child die through the eyes of his mother. You will be the victim and the witness. Keep that torch alive at all costs. The carriers have been chosen. Take your places. What do we do? We have to play along. Let's cross. Go forth and bring him the light. Much depends on it. This is unreal. It's Those cold. frescoes. The plague. They think it was caused by the child's death. So they don't have a macula? I don't think so. They interpreted all this. They made a god out of the carrier of the macula. Amicia. I think it's part of their ritual, drowning in the absence. <laughs> I'm cold. It's over. We'll soon warm up. <coughs> it was horrible. But you did it. I thought I was drowning. Calm down. You're fine now. No, I'm scared. The child is gone. <gasps> Just walk. I'm with you. He's dying in his mother's arms. Evil has won. Centuries pass. Famine, war, and plague descend on us. He dreams of fire every morn. You are back from the torches, God. Scared. You are not alone anymore. The child must meet his mother again. His embers glow in the dark. I am the mother, and I welcome him. Pass it to me. You did well. The child must rise again. Hear me, child. I am not barren anymore, for your flame lives in me. I am the mother. Become the phoenix. The child of fire reborn. Join us. Blow on these flames. <gasps> Life reignite his flame. May the breeze of life reignite his flame. May the breeze of life reignite his flame. May the breeze of life reignite his flame. Elsie, wake on. Not for now. We all look the same.
This is unbelievable. No kidding. <laughs>